and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm excited because I'm gonna be doing my very first Christmas decorate with me. So I'm gonna do this kind of vlog style. Not sure where I'm going with this because I bought a ton of stuff at Michael's for 50 and 60% off some items from Target. I also have some stuff from Hobby Lobby, so we have a whole variety. Now, I'm excited because this whole entire room is gonna transform. Let me show you what it's looking like right now. Let's do an overview of the room. We have a snowman down. I picked that up the other day from Hobby Lobby. Um, I just started putting out some decorations that I didn't wanna forget. So this is what the room looks like right now. I put up some fall decor, but not too much. So we're gonna be getting rid of that pillow. We have a thankful pillow over there. I found some of my Christmas pillows from last year and the previous years. And over here is where I had all my fall decor, except we're gonna be getting rid of all of that, the squirrel, the pumpkins, the leaves. All of this stuff was basically from Hobby Lobby. And then this was Home Goods and Pier 1 Imports, the little wreath. We're gonna be transforming this whole entire section also, we're gonna be putting up the Christmas tree in this corner and moving the bar cart. And obviously we need to open up some space. And over here we have the three seater on this side and the two seater. So what I thought was we're gonna move the two seater on this side, the three on this side, just because we need more space for the tree. And then that bar cart will probably go on this side or somewhere around there. Eventually I'm gonna switch out that lamp down below or some Christmas presents I already picked up. And here is all the stuff that I've been picking up within, that's a blanket I just washed for, washed from last year. Uh, we're gonna use all these tubs and all these decorations. I'm not sure, I don't think we're gonna use a, a lot of this stuff. We're gonna use basically all the new stuff that I picked out. And then I finally got myself a white Christmas tree. So my husband's gonna help put that together with me. And yeah, I'm excited. So this whole room is gonna transform even have some goodies over here on this side. Let's move this tripod right here. You can see a little before, a little before action, and then we'll see an after. Now we're gonna open up the tree I got, and I'm so excited. I wanted a white tree for a really, really long time. So this is the tree I got. It's not completely white, but it's flocked because I still wanted some green. So the tree that I got, it's like Blocked, but what we did was we just spread out the branches. I didn't want anything like too crazy and huge. I wanted something more on the thin side. Uh, it looks really pretty though. And we just will spread them out, add the decorations. And yeah, I like it just because it's like nice and thin. And then that's why I wanted to move this double couch here so that we have more space here and then I can decorate around it. Okay, so now the tree skirt that I went ahead and picked up was from Target. It was $40. Um, there were some that were like 45 to even 60. There was an all fur one, which I thought was really cute, but it was kind of tinted like yellow. So I just went with a cable knit tree skirt just because I thought it would just eventually just match everything. the tree skirt I think it looks really really pretty and then also I'm gonna be putting some decorations here on the side so then we'll fill up some space so here are some of the ornaments that I picked up I'm going for like a blush and champagne now I got this pack from Amazon and I got two more packs as well we have this one too which is so pretty and everything totaled to about $42 for all of these ornaments and then of course I use Ebates and I got cash back and then here is the third pack that I got, and it's probably one of my favorites, especially this bulb, because there's like wire inside the bulb, and I think they all look so pretty. I mean, I really wasn't sure because this is my first time ordering ornaments from Amazon, but they were a really good price, and they actually looked really pretty compared to the ones in store that are much more expensive. <laughs> Wonders of life got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy.
tree and I'm absolutely in love. I love the bow as the star for this one and I just love everything about it. So I just need to pick up one more uh, bundle of the flowers because now I know what I'm working with. All right guys, so now an update on the tree. Since I have filmed, as you know, I said that I wasn't sure what I was doing with the flowers and I didn't know how many I needed. But now that I put everything up, I knew exactly what I needed for the tree, so I didn't overbuy. So I went back to Michael's, got two more bundles of the flowers, and I went ahead and accented them all over, just so it was like more balanced. So now we have flowers scattered all around the tree. I found this little pink Santa hat in my little box of Christmas decor, so I just added that, just for fun sparkle. These sparkle so beautiful in person. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but it's really, really stunning. And then to fill up the tree a little bit more, I don't know if you can tell, but I have these little gold accents. And I got these from Target. They're $3 each, and I believe I got them on sale that day because they're having a sale on the decor for 30% off, I think. So I got a bunch of them just to kind of fill in and pop around the tree just to fill it up. And now the tree looks more full. I think next year I want to get a tree basket and I saw all um, beaded one on Pier 1 Imports. So I'll probably wait and hopefully they have it on Mega Sale and then I can use it for next year. So next up, we're going to conquer the mantle. We're going to put down the picture. I have other stuff to put up. Let me show you everything I picked up from Michaels and Target. I have all my branch bundles here, a whole bunch of stuff. I just literally grabbed everything. Those little birds are from Target. That basket is for UPS, FedEx, USPS. We're gonna put snacks and water bottles like last year. If you guys haven't seen my Instagram post, I have it up from last year, what we did, and it's just a really nice thank you. I also picked this little tree up right here. Super cute. I have this bow that might be the centerpiece, but I didn't want it too blingy because I didn't want it to kind of overpower the bow up there, so that's why I have a blingy one there. I got everything 50 to 60% off. This is a nutcracker my mom gave me. I already had that. And I also had that holographic little tree right there already. But everything else, Target. And then everything else is pretty much Michael's. So we're going to see what I'm going to do with this baby right here. moved around a ton of stuff and if you guys are watching I kept the tags on a lot of stuff just because Michael said I can return anything that I don't use within six months so obviously I bought a lot of stuff so I didn't want to just waste anything so I just wanted to make sure I placed everything and I'm gonna keep everything that I put so we're lucky because we have these little hooks right here so it's very easy to put these little side pieces so I just kind of snuck it in. There is this little ribbon but I, I really like it. I'm just going to keep it like that because it kind of blocks this portion. This is what I have so far. I'm going to fluff up this area a little bit more um, with the pine cones and glitter because it looks a little heavy on that side. And then here we go with the little frame. The two candles I already have in the bow. What's really cool about this frame is that when you reach in the back, it actually lights up right here. And these little trimmings as well. I'm gonna mess around with this area. I also added my gold Bath and Body Works candle holder just so we have a little bit more gold on this side because it seemed like this was kind of taking over, but the bow did help balance everything out just so we have like a little bit of gold. My first time really decorating and trying <laughs> for a Christmas mantle, so I like the way it turned out. For right now, I'm gonna keep this little snowman right next to the tree, and then this tree, I believe I'm just gonna set right here in the corner, just so it blocks that little outlet right there. We'll just stick that right there. I was thinking of putting the snowman like near him, but they're kind of both like the same level, so it doesn't really give dimension. Just to kind of fill in the gaps behind there, I might put some more stuff back there and obviously presents. Okay, so update, we had a couple Christmas balls left over, so I decided just to kind of fill in the gaps. 
and then just add them in and like the little spaces just to have them. So then I got this runner right here. I'm gonna put some stuff away that's underneath just to kind of trim it, it has a little bit of sparkle. And then I got this centerpiece from Michaels, $60 at Michaels, and I got it for 60% off. Now I went ahead and did the middle couches. I have a pillow for Pier 1 Import. This one was from Michaels, Pier 1 and Pier 1. I went ahead and added my little Bath & Body Works candle holder that I bought this year. I think that one looks really cute. So here's the overview. Ignore the stuff to the left because we have not finished that. We're gonna figure it out. I think everything just looks so pretty. What do you guys think? Just very nice and simple. I added a cute little comfy throw. Um, I'm gonna reposition the couches a little bit more. So now this area I never showed you. I got this sign from Target. So then we did this one. It's actually the third now that I'm doing the update. And then I just put my little Santa there, one of the bulbs just to kind of match. I wanted to get a runner, but I don't know. Like I said, I'm gonna do things little by little. And then I saw this wreath for 60% off and I got two of the flowers. I need a hot glue gun them. I haven't done it yet, but I'm gonna glue gun them into the wreath. And I think that one looks so pretty. I got it from Michaels when I went to go pick up more of the flowers. And I put those flowers there, obviously, so it can match the tree. But again, this one sparkles so much. I don't know, like when you walk by it, it looks so beautiful. I love it. And I love it that it was 60% off. So yeah, just very simple decor here. Then another addition is this throw. I got a blush pink one. Just to tie in a little bit more blush along with the tree. And this one's from... Pier 1 import, sorry, did I say that already? And I got 30% off for a Black Friday. And I basically think that's all the new stuff that I added to the room. So I just wanted to like update you with everything because I added, you know, little things here and there. <laughs> Standing up close by the Christmas tree Glimmering light, I am right where I want to be I'll be home for a couple of days hope you enjoyed the whole decorate with me I'm so happy we got it done I hope you enjoyed all my like little decor and stuff I tried my best like I said I haven't really decorated for Christmas before and it's just so exciting because we finally own our home and last year we really didn't get to decorate at all and it just made me so happy just to I don't know it just made me feel so good and honestly like I started kind of getting teary-eyed because this is like a dream to me so I just feel just very grateful that I'm able to even you know, decorate and get like these things from Michaels and all that. And it's just, I'm just so happy. Let me know down below any comments or any tips or anything like that. I would love to know because like I said, this is my first time. Be nice about it. And I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one. Boop, boop.